2007, a rampage through Akihabara would leave seven dead. The perpetrator was Kato Tomohiro, a Japanese auto mechanic from Aomori. In his youth, he lived a typical life for a young man from a small Japanese town. He worked hard, went to a good local school, and became an elite when he joined the prestigious Aomori High School. Continuous pressure from his parents to perform well, however, began to take a toll on Tomohiro, and this was exacerbated when he began to fall in his school rankings. His mother in particular held him to strict standards, meaning if he made any mistakes, she would enact cruel punishment, like forcing Tomohiro to eat scraps of food from the floor and forcing him to stand outside for long hours during winter. After school, and after failing Hokkaido University's entrance exams twice, he trained as an auto mechanic and worked in Saitama, but his mental health was damaged from the trials of his younger life and his failures, and he attempted suicide by driving into a wall. After recovering, Tomohiro was hired as a temporary worker in the Higashi Fuji factory of Kanto Auto Works living in Susano. He was a hard worker and earned a comfortable salary and was granted a one-room apartment that the employment agency rented. His personal life was very quiet and he exhibited the typical behaviors of a hikikomori. He'd lose himself in online forums and was infatuated with manga, video games, and animated pornography. A man who kept to himself until his world fell apart. In the morning of June 5th, 2008, Tomohiro showed up to work around 6am to find his work clothes were missing. He became livid and began to shout, prompting a colleague to alert their boss. However, by the time the boss came back and his colleague returned with his new uniform, Tomohiro was gone. He returned to his apartment under the assumption he'd been fired and posted several messages online complaining about what occurred. It is believed that this was what would cause the massacre. On June 6th, Tomohiro purchased knives, a telescopic baton, and a pair of leather gloves from a military supply shop. The next day, he came to Akihabara to sell his PC and some software to raise money to rent a truck. Then, on June 8th, Tomohiro drove 100 kilometers to Akihabara. Then, after waiting for shoppers to gather, he ignored a red light and rammed into a crowd, killing three people and injuring two. He then leapt out and began to stab bystanders killing four and injuring eight. Police chased and cornered him in a narrow alley before holding him down. Five died at the scene and the other two died from the wound sustained. After the massacre, his defense tried to argue he was not mentally stable, but this was quickly refuted with medical evidence and at the conclusion of his trial on March the 24th, he was found guilty of multiple counts of murder and sentenced to death. He still remains behind bars awaiting execution.